about 260 million children um, around the, the globe are not enrolled in primary or secondary education and millions more who are in, in school are denied quality education due to, to a lack of uh, educational resources and facilities. Without immediate action, in a, in a decade, about 800 million children, half of the world's youth, will lack the most fundamental skills required for future employment. We are here to prevent that from happening by leveraging higher tech to provide free access to higher quality education globally. Being mentored by Flapmax industry gurus really helped us bypass certain roadblocks that um, impeded our business growth. Flapmax and, and Microsoft didn't just leave us on the street. It, it, it's a long-term relationship helping us uh, accomplish milestone after milestone. I am the CTO and founder of K12plus.app, an AI-powered app that delivers higher quality education. I am a technologist who is committed to solving problems. I value technology and I have a degree in computer science. We, we are an educational technology company based in Namibia, focused on the kindergarten to 12th grade education sector. We are streamlining, digitizing, and automating academic and mundane tasks and school processes. We are gamifying and putting education in the metaverse, making it irresistible, enjoyable, engaging, and easier to do. We, we identify that uh, the education sector is in, is in crisis. About 260 million children um, around the, the globe are not enrolled in, in primary or secondary education. And millions more who are in, in school are denied quality education due to, to a lack of uh, educational resources and facilities. Without immediate action, in a, in a decade, about 800 million children, half of the world's youth, will lack the most fundamental skills for for required for future employment. We are here to prevent that from happening by leveraging higher tech to provide free access to higher quality education globally. Fantastic, that's a very inspiring passion, uh, solving education problem, which is a global problem. And we are quite impressed with what you're doing. And that will lead us to the next question for you. Uh, which is to talk about the sector you are operating, which you have already addressed, the educational sector. So we would look like to tell you to tell us uh, which one or more of the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals is your company, company targeting or addressing with what you do? And do you provide or does your product or service provide solutions to small and medium enterprises? And how do you do this? Uh, education and technology are great for sustainability. We are um, targeting sustainable development goal four by ensuring inclusive and equitable quality education and promoting lifelong learning opportunities for all. Um, at, at the moment, we we are not we are not um, providing uh, services to SMEs, but we are open to partnerships. We, we have seen there are few SME interested in reselling our products. Okay, that's good to know. Thank you. Uh, so uh, we would like to now come to your first experience. Uh, you know, like I rightly mentioned at the beginning, you are one of the few companies, part of the 12 selected from the over 800 applicants to the first uh, spring court. Uh, the, so we'd like to know your first experience. How did you get to know about the FAST Accelerator Program? How did you feel when you were notified of your acceptance? Uh, what were your expectations, experience with the masterclass, the facilitators, the FAST team? You know, tell us everything about how you feel about the FAST Accelerator Program, from how you felt when you got the notification to what your expectations were and whether they were met. 
the experience with the masterclass, the facilitators, and the staff. We are part of the 12 startups accepted into the program. Out of out of 800 applications submitted across across Af Africa, overall, uh, I will rate the masterclass, the facilitator, and staff a 9.9 .9 out of 10. It, it was an amazing experience, and of of, of course, um, a once in a lifetime opportunity that enhanced our skills enabling us to, to take on a significant degree of responsibility for, for our business growth. That's impressive, really impressive. Uh, okay, so how has the Fast Accelerator program helped with your business? Has it helped your business move forward? Uh, has it helped you gain further traction? Okay, I, I would like to point out that um, having a, a brilliant idea is not enough for business success. One needs uh, uh, to have skills and experience from the very beginning. And uh, I would like to, to convey my appreciation to Flapmax in partnership with Microsoft for granting us this opportunity to develop our skill set in the business ecosystem. And to, to add on that, uh, being mentored by Flapmax industry gurus really helped us bypass certain roadblocks that um, impeded our business growth. And to add on that, Flapmax and, and Microsoft didn't just leave us on the street. It, it, it's a long-term relationship helping us uh, accomplish milestone after milestone. Thank you, thank you. So uh, would you describe the experience with the running of your solution on Microsoft Azure Cloud or have, have you? If you have not, what's your plan for that? Uh, just tell us about your experience with the Microsoft Azure Cloud event. Cloud event. Uh, receiving up to 250,000 Azure credit has been a massive benefit to us. Um, it has taken the cloud computing burden off our shoulders and saved us money on our cloud bill as we grow. We, we are now capable and have the ability to build solution faster and turn ideas into application faster by not having to manage any infrastructure. So it's, it's really helping us to, to grow faster and turn ideas into solution and application faster. That's great, thank you. Uh, so I'll go further to a bit technical part, which is artificial intelligence. Are you leveraging artificial intelligence in your solution or do you plan to leverage it in the future? And how has the Flapmax team, technical team, uh, supported you with this journey, if at all? AI is, is at the heart of our solution. And uh, we are leveraging AI in so many different ways. For, for instance, identifying learners who are at risk of failure, predicting academic results, and ensuring uh, learners' success, and identifying learners who are at who are at the edge of dropping out of school through structured data points. And learning is, is no longer limited to, to time, uh, place or, or pace. Um, where humans cannot go, AI-powered bot will go. And what humans do not want to do, bots will automate. That's great to know. Uh, we, we, we see lots of possibilities happening. And uh, we, we, we are glad we're supporting this journey for you. Uh, we'll look at some key areas as well, going back to the FAST Accelerator program. What are your key takeaways from the program? Uh, would you have any advice to funders? And maybe one or two feedback to the FAST Marks, the FAST and Microsoft team. Our main key takeaway from the program is the SWOT matrix. It has helped us identify our strength, um, weakness, opportunities, and threats. And um, the advice I would like to, to give to other founders is not to, to look for a big problem. I, I, mean, I mean to look for a big idea, but rather focus on identifying uh, a big problem and provide value, which is key to a successful business. And of course, it, it's, a, it's a great initiative by Microsoft in partnership with Flapmax to support entrepreneurs across Africa 
by providing uh, them with technical skills, mentorships, and investment opportunities. I wish Flapmax and Microsoft the very best ahead. I will come back to your company now. Uh, would you say, uh, would you like to tell us, you know, how long has your brand, K12 brand, been in existence? And uh, of course, maybe you want to rehash again your core services. You want to tell us some of your breakthrough deals or any major announcements since you started the first accelerator program? Um, we have been in existence for, for two years. We we launched version one of the app in 2020. Version one is mainly focused on, on digitizing and automating school processes, including enrollment, admission, and school administration. So far, we have acquired about um, a thousand users, and the numbers are growing month to month. Our plan is to release version two of the application early next year. Version two comes with features um, curated to, for learners, uh, such as teacher bots, chat bots, and therapy bots, uh, and of course, virtual, real, uh, virtual reality, and a digital library that provides free offline access to curriculum and uh, fiction and non-fiction e-books. It's a global library accessible across political and economic and geographical borders. Uh, I would like to announce uh, that we, we recently secured funding from Salam Namibia in conjunction with Startup Namibia. A big thanks to Salam and Startup Namibia for helping us grow and and uh, achieve our goals. Okay, that's great. We, we're quite happy to hear that you're making progress and uh, be assured that we are here to support you all through your journey uh, in all forms, absolutely. We're impressed with, by what you do and the value you give to the society. And that's why we are very committed. The Microsoft team, the Flapmax team, the FAST team, uh, very committed to ensure that you succeed at what you do. And so we'll come back to you to say, how you rate the startup eco space in the country and you know Africa? Any challenges you would like to point out? Africa digital ecosystem has experienced tremendous growth in recent years, with 2021 seeing um, a record numbers of investments. And one of the biggest challenges faced by most startups in, in Namibia, Africa at large. It's, um, it's a lack of fundamental skills to, to build a, a successful business and um, securing funds for business growth. Being part of this program has given us the capacity and um, the ability to build a, a successful business. Thanks again to, to, uh, to Flapmax and, and, and Microsoft. That's great. That's really great. Africa is the future, like they say. We're excited that we are all getting ready to, to grab the future. But would you like to tell us about how you're leveraging your self-motivation, you know, your mentorship and professional networks to address any challenges you identified within your own space? I consider myself as a self-driven workaholic. I, I enjoy participating in free sessions to advance my knowledge in all aspects of, of life. Sometimes I, I really can't sleep at night knowing that I have a solution to the most critical problem in the world. So what keeps me going is, is the dream that I show up on the, on, the, on the planet to produce and life will seem useless and worthless without fulfilling my purpose on earth. Interesting. Uh, your workaholic approach is a rare, you know, a rare approach, but uh, we should be very best. And please find time to rest when you can. <laughs> All right. So uh, we, we, we're looking at a bit of things about, about your growth. And we'll be asking you, where do you hope to be as K-12 in three to five years as a business? Okay. Since we are enabling universal access to higher quality education, we are scaling to every corner of Africa and the world at large in the next few years and have an impact on a world population of 1 billion. We, we, as, we aspire to a subscri subscription of, of over 200,000 schools worldwide. It's essential for every child to be educated in order to reduce poverty, 
improve health and foster peace. That's really great and quite uh, a realistic and achievable mission you have there. I wish you the very best and we're glad to be of assistance to you, to support you. We want to assure you that Microsoft, Flatmax and the FAST team will be here to support you all through your journey. And we, we are glad that you're building something impactful on the society. I wish you the very best.